Member statements, the Honourable Member for Lajemogier. As a very challenging year winds down to a close, the Christmas season is upon us. With the struggles we are currently facing as a society, most of us can turn to our families for love, comfort and solace. There are many in our communities, however, that do not have that stability and not only face loneliness and lack of supports, but also poverty. Thankfully, there are a number of compassionate goodwill organizations in our city who exist solely to help those desperately in need. Siloam Mission is one such organization whose mission as a Christian humanitarian organization is to assist those affected by poverty and homelessness and help them through their most difficult times by giving them opportunities that they could never have found on their own. Those with nowhere else to turn find themselves in a place that gives them hope, starting with a warm meal and includes clothing and shelter. Silo Mission and similar organizations rely on donations in order to exist. These donations are crucial to assist them in maintaining their daily operations and giving them the ability to expand their services. Donations of clothing provide their guests with essentials to keep them clothed and warm, especially during the bitterly cold winter months here in Manitoba. Food donations are the lifeblood that feed those in daily need of nourishment. I have volunteered for Slow Mission in the past by delivering donations of food and clothing, as well as serving food to their guests. This year, more than ever, I urge you to do your part to help those in need. In order to assist this in our community, I have partnered with Slow Mission and have set up a food clothing donation bin an accessible location. We will be accepting new canned, box and package non-perishable items, as well as winter clothing items such as coats, sweaters and blankets. Your contribution is one that will help many this Christmas season and beyond. Last Friday, I spoke with Jim Bell, the CEO of Salon Mission, and he wishes the best to all of our members of the Manitoba Legislative Assembly. And in closing, I wish all of you a safe and blessed Christmas and a happy new year.